Hello, it's June 20th, 2016, and here's the current state of the horseradish area. It has taken up all of its area and more, <laughs> as you can see by this little uh, colony right there. There is uh, cardboard in here, but horseradish does not seem to mind, and it's gone as far as it can. See how big these leaves are. They get up to about three feet. Uh, you'll see a couple bites in there and that is from slugs which is my best guess. I've used sluggo and they're not quite as badly chewed up since. If you want to get all the way down and dirty in here you can kind of see where each node kind of shoots off its own leaves. That's how it kind of works. And those are the spots where you'll eventually dig up and uh, try to grab a root. It goes all the way back there. It just It's got some territory where it can keep going in the back. Um, so that's kind of where I want it to go. If it starts heading this way, I generally try to pick it and move it. And this year, uh, for my friends, I've got some in this little, <laughs> little tiny bucket here. Um, so I can give it away if people want it or whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm looking at harvesting probably September, October, and we'll see how it goes.